You are the editor in chief of your life. And if you think about the role of Anna Wintour, an editor in chief, it is to determine the look and the feel of the publication, to have the final say in what's published and what isn't. If you think about everyone brings Anna Wintour ideas for Vogue, they place them on her table. Imagine if she just let all of those ideas, all of those words, all of those images into a publication, what a hot mess it would be. But that's often what we're doing to ourselves. We've got all these thoughts and we're paying attention to them and we're believing them. And then we wonder why our lives don't feel elegant and why we feel overwhelmed and chaotic and why it's so hard to create the results that we want to create. Every month, Vogue has a theme and Anna Wintour is very intentional and purposeful about the words, the colors, the, the tone about the imagery of what she allows into Vogue for that month and what isn't allowed. Well, you get to do the same thing with your life. And it all begins with your thinking, what thoughts are you allowing yourself to indulge in that aren't serving you? They aren't serving the theme that you have for your life. They're not serving the goals that you have for yourself or the woman you want to be. As the editor in chief of your life, you're gonna have to determine how you want your life to look and to feel and selectively decide what thoughts are supportive of your vision and which ones aren't. So I want you to be thinking about what is the tone of your desired thinking? <laughs>